Well guys, we are looking at Godzilla to do a spacey score and for some reason, unlike the other tables, we don't have a nice scrolling 3D view before we start. So we're just going to have to get straight into it. Got some of these uh, watery uh, sling tops here, reminiscent of the fishtails table, right? Um, but yeah, let's get straight into it guys so we can see the whole table and see what Godzilla is all about. Immediately some pretty imposing sounds. <laughs> Destruction bonus, oh look at that. So many shots here to to take a gazillion lights. It's like I'm I'm playing a jackpot machine. It reminds me of one of those you guys in the UK, one of those pub uh, slot machines with all those lights. But that's cool. It's so. Uh, it's so open in the middle here. You've got pl plenty to, to shoot. Feels feels like a wide body. Wow, that's a that's some sound. <laughs> I like that. Okay. Got the right there. Don't want to make you man. Top rollovers. Looks like Godzilla's on the move. Yeah, quite nice, couldn't get up that ramp. Again, yeah, it does seem seem quite far away the shots, but physics are nice. Uh, flipper's got the right sort of power on it. Along with the table speed. So you get sort of this. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'd give it the table speed. I should have had that shot, but um, yeah, it's a nice balance going on there. All right. Very cool how he shoots the ball out there. <laughs> cool to go up one way and then up the same ramp the other way. Uh, It'll take more than that to make the king give up. Oh, wow. Whew. Whew. We've learned all we can. Terminated. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, we're going to go again. We're going to go Godzilla again. Will take humanity's place yeah, strange as it doesn't go off on its own little cycle here, but anyway. Stop this table is packed. Looks like Godzilla's on the move. He's charging up. Godzilla is here, attacking our facility. Hey! Watch out. It'll take more than that. Whoa! <laughs> Love that. Be careful. Don't want to make him angry. You have no idea how much carnage these monsters can do. That'll be a big one. Oh. Come on, big guy. <laughs> Back up. 
Oh, I'm actually not saying a lot in this, this table, guys. I'm actually really enjoying just getting in and playing the ball here and sort of searching around for what I, I need to do next. It's sort of like we haven't unlocked any sort of major modes though, which is a bit of a shame. And that's probably because I'm going to so many things that are lit up. Commence emergency evacuation process. Whoa. Whoa. No personnel remain. Activate self-destruct. Oh. That's the last we've seen of him. Man, I was actually enjoying that ball. <laughs> wow. Do I hit next? Up. Like a Christmas tree. Got all the helicopters are uh, out lit. Bit of space in the music there. It comes back in. Ah. Yeah. Can't save it, guys. Can't save it. So terrifying at the same time. He will recover. <laughs> it sounded a little bit cheesy, but it's still cool. All right, guys, I think we're gonna we're gonna have a chat and and rank this. Lots to talk about here, uh, guys. Theme is it's you know, and, and other than the fact that it's Godzilla, it translates well into the table for sure. Uh, always, you know iconic monsters are always going to do that uh, it's easily easily a nine for theme atmosphere this is a little bit like i mean this has come out in the tri pack along with kong and kong versus godzilla but it's a bit like kong and it's, it's atmosphere uh you know it's right up there it it, it feels great you, everything's going on uh sound the sound effects the animation all builds into a really really cool and nice atmosphere so yeah, we're right up there again. Um, yeah, it's a nine, nine for me for atmosphere. Layout, realism of this table. Well, this, I must admit, this table is really, really nice. I love these ramps. These ramp shots are cool. Be able to go up this ramp on, on both ways is really nice. Uh, and the little ramps coming down, down the side is really cool. It's nice and open. There's so many shots. As I said, it feels like a wide body table, guys. And there's just lots to do so much there and then these rollovers i like multiple rollovers at the bottom as well bumpers you know kicking off at the top there overall and i'm looking at this table and just thinking wow if this was a physical table yeah it's right up there it's right up there um you know i try to try and think to myself when do i give tens uh for for layout and uh you know it's going to be subjective clearly between people but i think this one does deserve a 10 for layout i really do like it all right so table artwork okay well this is an interesting one it's it's so um overwhelming in terms of everything that's on here um with all the targets and it's uh it, it's crazy in terms of its, its first impression and everything else <coughs> is done really well is it professionally and that that whole back scenery with the the cityscape and stuff it's really, really nice. So yeah, I think this one deserves, and the colors and stuff are so beautiful. So this is a nine, we're, at, we're nine up on the artwork for sure. Animations, really cool. The Godzilla animations, the, sh the shooting out, the, out of his mouth, you know, the, the fire, it's just like crazy. It's, it's really cool. And there's nice little subtle bits of animation in here. It, very good and probably didn't kick off a number of other things that I probably could have seen um there's like a little whirlpool on the side there as well so yeah i think animations up there we're going to give it a eight 
uh, graphical effects, uh, the effects on top of it, which is probably more in relation to that laser fire coming out of his mouth and bits and pieces, all fitting for the game, really fits in there nicely. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the effects up at, at eight. Lighting, again, really nice for a cabinet table, guys. Um, they, as I keep saying, they can look flat if they don't get the lighting right. I think this is, this is good. It didn't dynamically change too much though, but it, it's, it's still very solid and it's worthy because it just looks nice. I can't really complain about it. I'm gonna give it an eight on the lighting. DMD, DMD's nice. Um, it's clear. It tells you what's going on. It sort of didn't get in my way. It sort of fit in really nicely from that perspective, uh, from from a gaming point of view, and just playability. So, and it's the new, you know, the new full fam format graphical D DMD. Uh, yeah, it, it deserves an eight for sure. Uh, music, yep, the music was fitting, uh, very dramatic. Um, maybe a little touch too loud in, in terms of balance and of course I could change that balance but just yeah it was just a little bit there but uh, overall very very good I think I'm going to give it um, not outstanding though so I'm going to give it an eight on the music side of things sound effects very good yep every shot just again felt right nothing there sort of missing in terms of again any weirdness or feeling like I'm not getting half a game in terms of sound effects, I'm going to give it a 9. I'm going to give it a 9 because, yeah, there's not a lot more room for improvement there. I really do like it. Some really, really cool sounds coming through there. Um, call-outs, yep, there was a few call-outs. Some of them sounded a little cheesy with the voice acting. Uh, they all seemed to be fairly relevant. They were mixed in pretty well it made it sort of feel like a bit of a story going on and that you're traveling along with that so yeah it was pretty good and I think it deserves a good seven for a call out flow uh, absolutely heaps of flow here uh, flicking around all over the shop and with the space and stuff so really really nice good flow so I think it's a uh, deserving of a nine we get to shot interest there's so many shots here <laughs> so are they interesting? I mean, there's a lot, you know, on the perimeter here that's sort of on this radius. Um, so maybe there's a little, a little interest lowers a little bit there, but they still, you, you got to be satisfied when you take the shots and that's the really important thing. Um, so I feel like shot interest, just given the scope of the table and just even, it helps with the layout and the design. So I'm going to give it an eight guys um, for shot interest. Challenge without a, a doubt, a challenge and, um, yeah, I've worked up a sweat here playing this. Uh, and that's from just fully concentrating and getting into it. I think this is a, it is a really good challenging table. So this, this I'm gonna give it a nine, guys, for challenge. Physics feel was good. Did find there was one bouncy um, uh, flipper shot just as I was setting this up to hold this here. Uh, but I, I didn't feel like anything was really weirdly wrong in the game, but maybe a little bit, a little bit bouncy. I can't really fault it though. We're going to keep on with our, our solid eight unless we see something that really deviates there, guys. So it's an eight on the physics. Fun factor. Yep, it's fun. In fact, the moody nature of the table doesn't take it away from it being feeling like it's fun just because the sheer number of shots. Um, so for me, it, it was fun to play. Uh, and so that scores reasonably highly um, because it's you know it's obviously solid challenging table so the fun factor is still there though good good ooh I was gonna go seven but I don't think that's fair so I'm gonna go eight on the fun factor because it is fun fun table for sure um, layout definitely helps all that side of it for replayability without a doubt as you can probably tell with all the the high ratings that we've had through so far there's too many good things about this table definitely one to come back to play. And I'm hoping, I think there's sort of more to this table and I just haven't found it yet just because the sheer number of shots and the things that I need to sort of work out. Uh, so this is definitely one I'm coming back to guys. It's going to rate highly here on the replayability. I'm going to give it a nine. All right, and the X factor. Well, anything super duper over the ordinary. It's interesting, like all of those other things that I said uh, are all worthy in all the particular areas of those ratings. Does it have something else? I don't know if it does, actually. Um, it's 
a cool overall package and that might give it a one. I don't think I've unlocked what might be something that would give a bit bigger X factor, guys. So for now, I'm gonna to have to leave it um, and give it a, a rather measly one. But uh, of course, I think with all the other scores, this is gonna be a pretty high rating table on the Stacey's uh, scores listing. So there you have it, guys. That is Godzilla. And uh, we keep rolling through all the Zen originals and license tables. What will be the next one? Uh, if you want to know, want to contribute to what you want to see next, then uh, just put your comments in the comments below and also let me know your feelings about this table. Give it a like if you like this sort of content, guys, and we'll keep it coming. Until next time, keep flipping. Ciao for now.